Today I am at the north end of Last Mountain Lake, which for more than a century has been a national wildlife area. Back in 1887, it became the first federally protected bird sanctuary in all of North America. And it's birds that bring me here today. As autumn takes hold of our province, a number of migratory bird species are adding a bit more life to our living skies. That means an influx of birds and an opportunity to see some species you may not be able to see throughout the rest of the year. Oh yeah, that fence really is electrifying. Although this pelican was by itself, they often forage for food in a group. They'll coordinate their swimming to corral fish in the shallows where it's much easier to scoop them up with that massive bill. And despite what Saturday morning cartoons have taught us, pelicans will never actually carry food in that pouch, they'll actually swallow before taking off. One of my favorite migratory visitors to Saskatchewan is the Sandhill Crane. They spend the summer in the northern reaches of North America breeding and nesting, and right now they're migrating south to Mexico and the southern United States where they will spend the winter. They are the most common species of crane in the world, but unlike the birds that I've seen so far today, they don't spend time in water or near water. They prefer grasslands and rolling prairies, so I'm going to have to go look elsewhere to find some. really don't need to know much about birds to enjoy exploring Last Mountain Lake. That last bird, I have no idea what it was. I think it was a bittern. Uh, the bird book would certainly help, but uh, I forgot that in the car, so I'm gonna have to check when I get back. All right, back at the car, got the bird book. Time to find out what that last one was. So this is the bird in question. I kind of have an idea of what it is. It's either a bittern, which is the one on the right here, or a juvenile green heron, that guy down there. It's not my intention to sound like a used car salesman, but these birds are here for a limited time only. So if you want to catch a glimpse, you better make it soon because John Snow's right, winter's coming.